the Tanjiro swords have been broke by Rudy's revs, in which he actually is in a disadvantage, which we seen Inosuke actually saw Ginyo defeated the father, who actually told him that he's not one of the 12 demon moons. And during his irate behavior, he actually decided to tie him up on the tree. While meanwhile, we saw, I mean, Sensu actually try to slow down the poison, which we saw Shinopu actually administrate the antidote for him. Which she is actually impressed that he used the breathing technique to slow it down. In which we saw the rest of the Demon Slayers taking care of the other victims who almost transformed into spiders. Meanwhile, we saw Tanjiro getting ready to be Rudy while he told his younger sister to stand back while he used the rev on against him. But then Nisuko actually was actually sent away by taking the revs for Tanjiro and then we seen him trying to tend to his in to her injuries while we saw Rudy actually saw the bond that Tanjiro and Nisuko actually have in which he actually took it out on his younger sister who actually say that this is what he wanted but he actually say the role that he gave his family didn't actually was fulfilled. So he actually told her to kill anyone who also trespassing the mountains. In which we actually seen Rudy asking Tanjiro to hand over Nisuko. In which he refused. In which we see him actually talking about the roles that he actually gave to his family in which we saw Rudy reveal himself as the true member of the 12 demon moons, in which we seen him taking Nisuko by force with his threads, in which Nisuko actually cuts him and then actually have him hang up on the tree by his threads, which he actually cuts through to her. In which I mean, Tanjiro getting ready to fight Rudy after what he did to Nesuko. In which we see him using the 10th form constant flex on the threads. But however, he can't cut through his neck because of the reps. In which he using his blood demon art cutting thread cage on Tanjiro. Which he actually haven't had time to dodge it. But then we seen the life before his eyes. And we seen the backflash of Tanjiro and Nesuko as children. Or actually practicing their dance with their father Tanjiro. Who actually appeared to be a sickly man. Who actually does the dance called the Hanakami. Which is actually the dance that he did to bless his family the new year which his mother explained to him what it actually does in which his <clears throat> Kagura dance that he will actually do which he passed down all of those to him in which his family actually used fire for his dance in which Tanjiro decided to use that technique which he actually called his technique called the Hano, I mean the Hano Kama, Kami Kagura dance, which he actually used fire now, which is actually pretty cool against Rudy, in which he using the flames to cut through the threads, which he used based from his father, as he used the fire to cut through the revs and get ready to cut down Rudy, which Nezuko actually have. Uh, encouraging words from their mother to help Tanjiro and so she using her first blood demon art exploding blood on the threads and Tanjiro getting ready to cut his neck and with the help of Nesuko's blood on the sword we seen the cutting 
actually happens with the fire technique. And I have to be honest, this is actually a great technique to use for Tanjiro. Honest, the fire sword technique was actually amazing, including the song that was actually used for the scene. It was actually incredible. And then the song actually played throughout the credits. And I have to say, this episode is actually incredible and awesome and amazing. And I cannot wait to see what's going to happen on the next episode next weekend. So anyway, like this video, subscribe for more, and comment on what you think about the episode. You guys can also follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr, and like my Facebook page. Until then, this is Anime Guy Dragon here saying sign out. Laters!